2013, I was working on a project with John Lever. We were moving a large crocodile through Australia for a specialist display. With that in mind, I thought this would be a very good option for Dubai Aquarium. So having known that the crocodile exists, I decided to approach EMA and to present to them how this project was actually feasible. After talking it over, looking at the crocodile, the benefits that it'll bring, we decided to give it a try. So we sent him to Australia to take a look at the crocodile, judge its health, and observe firsthand the size of it. We decided to reassess after that. After documenting his size, I could confirm to the company that this animal was going to be of international interest. Capturing a crocodile and building an exhibit format at the same time wasn't enough. We had an aquarium that we needed to keep open for 12 hours a day. So what we did was we scheduled the quiet works for daytime and did the main works overnight. It was very, very stressful on the team, but because we had a crocodile coming, the timelines weren't changing, we just had to make it happen. Whilst building a king croc display here in Dubai sounds challenging enough, the real big challenges were actually back in Australia. Other challenges included a transport. This crocodile's too big to go on a regular aircraft. In transport, you have to have contingency plans. Where do we have to go to? Uh, what is the final destination? And that's what you need. You need people that are passionate, people that care, but that's what it's all about. The third challenge is getting the permits from the Australian government. That's not easy as well in that they will only release these animals to reputable aquariums. We had to demonstrate our integrity, our uh, education department, the number of guests we have per year, and how we plan to display this animal to a large range of, of nationalities. Now we're getting to the dangerous part. The water level's dropping low enough, so uh, shortly we'll be able to see him. And once he's exposed, he'll feel a bit threatened, so which will then make him a lot more aggressive towards us. Whoop. Hopefully all the years of experience will shine through and we've got a good team here, so we should be able to get him. Hey. This thing here that we just caught is a monster. Certainly his weight was a challenge. Everyone's tired, and uh, but we're only halfway. The injections themselves, that's for not only the safety uh, of the staff, but it's also for the safety of the crocodile. Fitting, making a tailor-made solution for them that, that will help them to make sure that the crocodile will arrive there in perfect condition. So this is what the purpose of this design is. We've got him up on the bank and we've got a little bit more work to do before he's in his transport container and then the journey to Dubai. I think this croc is going to be a symbol of the birth of UAE. They're just going to go uh, and both become mega things, you know, they're both big. 